I'm wearing my father's watch and I will wear it again next weekend to honor my dad. And there's a moment for me personally, when I read this story, I, I just thought about this little Timex my dad gave me. My, my dad left a couple things behind when he died. He, he left an old school pair of Ray-Bans, a pack of smokes and a lighter, and uh, this Timex watch that is probably not worth a whole lot to a lot of other people, but it just feels like it's priceless to me. And uh, even though it's been 11.03 all weekend long, um, <laughs> I still wear it to honor my dad, but I think about a father that gave a watch to his son that was priceless. The father knew that it was priceless, and he wanted the son to understand the significance of the price that the watch was worth, but he wanted to see what other people would say the price was. And so he said, son, listen, I'm going to give you this watch, and I want, I want you to go down to the pawn shop. I want you to go to the jewelry shop, and I want you to go to meet with a person who is able to determine the worth of pieces of antiquity. He's at the museum and he'll be able to help you. He, he's really knowledgeable and just tell him I sent you. And so he takes the watch and he goes down to the pawn shop. And even though the watch didn't work and it was a little scratched up and banged up and beat up, he goes, sir, how, how much would you give me for this watch? And the pawn shop owner said, well, I, I'd give you $10. It's scratched up. It doesn't work. And he said, okay. And so he went to the jewelry store and the gentleman behind the counter said, I'll give you a hundred dollars for it. And then he went to the curator, which is at the museum, the friend of the father. And he laid the watch in front of him and he began to hold it up. And he goes, huh? He goes, this watch, even though it doesn't work, it's banged up. It's about 200 years old and it's worth $300,000. And he goes back to his father and he goes, dad, you knew that, didn't you? Oh, God. He goes, sure did, son. He said, I need you to know that if you're not careful, you allow people to put a price tag on you that do not recognize the value within you, and you will actually discount yourself in places that you go. So don't stay long in places or with people that discount you to feel better about themselves. Surround yourself with people that'll see the value of who you are, and better yet, whose you are.